mega arms. Uh, in this episode, we're going to be teaching my cousin here, Zach, for arm wrestling before. And well, I'm gonna go over some basics with him on the top roll real quick, just to show you guys what exactly I think a top roll is.
60 pounds, 30 reps. Holy smokes. The key to this exercise is you don't want to cut it like this. You want to cut it like that, so that way you get Okay, so you're not using more. your thumb for support. Yeah, you're not using your thumb to, to grab a hold of it. That's going to limit your mobility. You need a lot more wrist strength. You, know, you access all of your fingers when you put your thumb behind the okay. like this. And we just... I keep my body nice and tight to the table, my arm down to the pad, keep a keep this tight my bicep, fully engaged right here. Nice. And then just 30 reps. Damn, nice. Just pop this like, out. I feel like this would be a good workout for even weight I mean, just normal bodybuilding. Yeah, right here, that's that's fully engaged, hundred percent. I bought a pair of fat grips. I used to love those things. I use them on everything. Oh yeah. It makes uh benching better. Yeah. Uh, it makes everything harder. Right, I do them on like, pull ups a lot. Dang. Yeah, that, was, that was brutal. You feel it all? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Like, even up here, I'm like. Yep, you're fully engaged all the way through here when you're staying tight like that. Nice. You already got like a net like a really natural arm wrestling position. I feel like this this arm feels a little more natural with it. Yeah. So I'd probably be left handed. When you're cupping in like that, that's that's the thing, that's like the final process of uh, you know closing your bicep too. That's where you get good strength that comes from that. Hell yeah. Woo. Did you buy these specifically for uh, Yeah, this is specifically for arm wrestling. Nice. Yep. You just bring them with you every day or every you just day. Here? Yep. My dad wants to go on some fishing trips over the winter, so I, I mean, yeah, if you want to tag along with us, that'd be awesome. I've never really been fishing, but I've always wanted to. Yeah? Hey, yeah, you're asking me if I could. It's fun. Try incorporating some, uh, yeah, some of the black That makes it like, it's kind of hard for real. It makes it harder to contain with your fingers. Yeah. yeah. I like that. You could like try and like almost like curl your body in front of it so that way it's like a defensive, like and that way you're keeping it contained. Okay. Yeah. yeah, that's nice and tight. Cause I'm not at all computer savvy. Me neither. I know how to work video editing yeah. and Photoshop. <laughs> Everything I've learned, I learned from that. That my friend is like an IT dude. Oh yeah. He runs like IT for school delivery. I'm gonna change it up now. I'm gonna go to the side.
even if you're just holding it there, it's working. There you go. <laughs> like 11 inches. 11 inches? Yeah. Do you know what they are now? Uh, six, 16 and a half? 16? I, I think that was my the peak, the biggest time I ever. Yeah. It could be right now, but. Just try and get your elbow into right there. Yep. That gets your bicep way more engaged. Yeah, you can use your other hand to a little bit. That's good. So let's take the table here. In the top, all right, feet first. We're going to start with the feet first. It's always important to get your hips close to the table, on the table, all right? So for a left hand, you're going to put your left foot forward, all right? There you go. And that's good. That's, we're making our body angle towards our hip. So you have angles towards the hip. All right. But we're, eventually we're going to have to square the shoulders. Okay. So just like this, it's fine. For, um, okay. So we start with the feet. Now we go up to the, we got the hips. Now we arm placement. Arm placement is pretty important. We want to, you know, everything has to stay set up. So when we grip up right here, for a good top row, that your outside corner of the pad is probably going to be where you want to, where you want to start, okay? And you're going to want to drag back. And with the top of you want to come. You want to pull, I say pull with these two fingers, like this. I pull that way. So if you do that to me, cover your, cover your finger like that. See, now it locks you in like that, yep. And now you're able to, yeah. And, yeah, but don't just, just, don't just go on. Go. The whole entire body. I'm gonna, you're gonna be able to keep all of your friends and arms, alright? So stay, stay, you're taller than stay over top of your hand. See how I'm over top of my hand like that? Yeah. You, get, you get it nice and tight, keep this right here, okay? Yes. Yep. Oh, that's strong. That's real strong. Yeah. I'm telling you. Okay, but now if you were to do this and go to the side with it, it'd be and pull everything, put your whole entire body in. And very, very important that when you're uh, going to the top of the position. Your elbow right here, you fall down below the table, all of this. This, is, this right here should fit perfectly over that, pulling the whole, all of your body weight right there. You don't even have to grip a whole grip on it. When I, when I arm muscle, I do this. And then just hold like that. And then if I have to, I'm, I'm pressing like that. We'll go right here. And, and get inside, stay on top of your body, real, real tight. Yep. You're, you're just going straight with your hand. Okay? And like this. Oh, like, like, like that. Yep, pull. Yeah, see, you got, I know you got, I know you got strong, bro. Right, you could, you could easily bust me back like that. Yeah, I guess you're right. You, with work, with work, Zach, I'm telling you, you've got, you've got good technique already. Right. Stand up a little higher. Right now. There you go. Right. Go. All right. Now you're, you're going all this side. Okay. Here's one. Here. Do this. Ready? Move, move your elbow to this corner. Down. Here. Okay. Right. Get up. Get nice, tall on top. Stay. Keep your elbow inside of your body like this. Go. Yep. Yep. See, you're already. You it hurts. hurts. It hurts. It hurts. A little bit. Okay. Don't do that. <laughs> Let's do left hand. I don't know if I was doing it wrong. Or it's. It's just. It's still the technique. Yeah. It's. It's all in the part. Of the Try staying inside. Try reaching this shoulder to the. And now get all of your body behind it, kind of. You know I'm saying, move your hips over a little bit. Can. See now how your angle is already closer to there. Yep, yep, yep. See? Yeah. Now you're, you just gotta work on the. You can move someone in an arm wrestle, you can move them that far. Literally, if their arm stays here, you can move their whole entire arm that much just from opening up their wrist. So, you wanna think on, think about like cutting down or going over top, right? So, pull with these, these two fingers just back towards you in like a lifting motion. Yep, that's, oh my gosh. You work, I swear to you, you work, 
You can bust people's hands back, no problem. Down, down. Great. I think your left arm is definitely your strongest arm, your stronger arm. Yeah. Yeah. It feels a little more natural. Um, maybe instead of the, hook, the top, we try a, a, a hook. Okay. Okay. So with the hook, like a, like a, get more in line with your body. Yep. This. Well, you're outside your body now. Okay. Yep. In, inside there. So that way, when, when the ready go happens, your elbow is already inside, and now all you have to do is. You know, like cup your wrist in like that. That would be that would be a hook for you. If you just so just bring these knuckles or these fingertips down to there for me. Okay. Yep, that that's it, that's your hook. Yeah, just and yep, don't no, you turn you turn around like that. When you're in a hook, you wanna get your shoulder behind. Okay, like Yep, so kind of almost kinda... lean into it. And then and then you transition into the press. Oh, okay. Like this, so you do, bang, bang. and everything stays tight, safe, nice and safe. Never, never out here. Okay, you think that's why it felt weird? Yeah, that's right. why it might hurt a little bit. Yeah. All right. So let's try that with the. Again, get these fingers, try and touch them down there, while dragging everything and stay tight. This tight, and that tight. Yep. 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 You're gonna have if you if you kept up at this, dude. I tell you, you could get it. This one is much more difficult. It wants to roll out of your hands. Yeah. And you're gonna. The pressure in your fingertips. Okay. Yeah. Oh, just broke my hand. That's all right. Can't do it. That's your left arm. Yeah. So your left arm may be stronger, but the the mobility factor may be a little different. Uh, I think I, I think my arm is a little toast. Right oh now. yeah. Let's see if I can do a, a one-arm pull-up. 